I'm here with Andy, looking at uh, Andy and Joe's shack. That's where they live. If anybody wants to blackmail them. <laughs> so I'm here with Andy. Uh, Andy, it's kind of kind of run me through your setup and let me know what you got going here. Pretty much, we got a six and a half by fourteen foot shanty, two and a half inch walls, weighs about twenty five hundred pounds. <laughs> got a rubber roof on it. And like you see, that's for tip up fishing. So you turn the light on, you can see outside a little better, you know. And then, uh, What's the lights are for, huh? The uh, frame on the shanty is a bull built frame. It's really clogging away. You can do 60 miles an hour down the road, and I weigh about 150 pounds. And I can set it up and take it down myself. I'll show you how it works. Here. Down, so all you gotta do is pull down, right? Pull down and lock it. Oh, jeez. Get a little muscle on it. Don't stand on that there. And then basically, when you get it down here, you just lock in the two pins and you're on the road. This is the uh, door we purchased at Menards for $2 because it had some dents in it, I believe. Looks good. Thank you. Looks like we uh, looks like everything's trimmed out. Um, a lot of uh, a lot of handles and gizmos and gadgets. It's kind of I don't know. Show me around. Well, basically we have uh, six lights, as you can see, on uh, three separate dimmer switches. So that way, when you're fishing and a guy's grilling, you just have one light on. So you guys got mood lighting in here. Yes, yes we do. Take advantage of that. Oh, um, and then uh, we have the shanty has three windows in it, and they all have the window closer things on them. Slides? Yes, slides. <laughs> um, this is for when you get restless and you stand up and look over the surgeon hole. So you got one hole in here? Yes, yeah, so you're actually standing on the hole. One hole, bench on the end. And the bench uh, opens up. Got your decoys in here? Yes, we have our decoys and all our storage in here. So this, from what I understand, is Joe's Joe's contraption? Yes, that is actually Bob's very good luck. So this is the Slayer, huh? Yes, the Sturgeon are just so attracted to the to the uh, reflectiveness. Uh, works. And then the coffee cans, then we've gotten hundreds of fish. So how many fish have you caught out of the shack? One. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is our gaff hook. It's actually a Louisville Slugger bat with a gaff hook on the end of it. Nice. Uh, so what uh, what, are, what are the reels you have on the wall here? All the reels are actually for our decoys. You just push the button, pull it down, and then set your height. And then if you want to reel it up, just reel it up. Huh. Not bad. Some fat and get a TV in here once in a while? Yes, yeah, so when we go like, tip up fishing or jigging, we always throw the TV in. So I, I see the bench. What's this? This is actually our bar here. Um, and behind the bar, we have a little grill, the toaster. Uh, we have 120 and 12 volt power in the shack. Uh, this is our ice, ice chipper. <laughs> If you're chipping the ice in the hole, if you ever um, need to do that. You got an oven in here too, or just a stove? Oh, uh, just the just the stove. <laughs> microwave? Oh, uh, we're actually thinking we'll put an oven in next year. Maybe a microwave or a pizza oven or something. You guys play a lot of darts? Yeah, we actually tend to play darts a lot in the shack. So, so, so do you guys fish in here actually, or are you just screwing around? Oh, a little bit of both. <laughs> Depends on the day. Sturgeon Spear, no screwing around. Fishing more screwed around than fishing. Cool, well, uh, thanks for taking us through. Hey, no problem. It's nice to meet you. you. <laughs> it's about 6 o'clock, opening morning of the 2010 
sturgeon spearing on Lake Winnebago. You can see the trail of headlights of people making the pilgrimage out on the lake. There's one guy that just got to his shack. He's probably getting the heater cranked. We got our heater going. We just got done skimming the ice off of our shanty. Off the holes and inside our shanty. About 6.30 when the season opens. To bring the spears in. And sit and wait. Somebody better run and get it quick. So Sean, how dumb do you feel right now? <laughs> yeah, somebody better go get it. What, what time is it? Yeah, you got time yet. Yeah. Oh, you got plenty of time. Yeah, Sun hooked that I mean, trailer and somebody running well, get it. Take the sled. 6-11. Can you buy it at the gas station? Fishing license? Yeah, yeah, you should be able to buy one here. Don't look at me, I can't drive. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose we should go off. Unhook that trailer quick. Yeah, it sounds like a bitch. <laughs> Well, have well, one. Well, why you got me thinking? Right on my license, my <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a tag. I forgot it at home. It's like right. it's Bloody Mary's ass. Six minutes till it opens, Sean. Where's your tag? Here's my tag. It's uh, at my house. Where's your fishing license? And here's my license. <laughs> I didn't think I had a fishing license last time. Who's prepared? <laughs> that guy. <laughs> Who's not prepared? That guy. <laughs> as you can see, it's as you can see, it's getting lighter out. It's now about 15 minutes before before the season starts. People are still coming out. Temperature is about eight degrees. What? <laughs> you want a nice, right? Sean, please, sure. This is Sean calling his wife in the morning. Does it say 09? <laughs> Trying to find his sturgeon tag, which is 20 miles away from here. <laughs> We're lucky Sean don't live up north somewhere. <laughs> Loser! <laughs> what the hell? Hmm. He doesn't even have one. I, I know I oh, have yeah, one. I bought it. Hmm. Wanna go try to buy another one? <laughs> Maybe you take your deer with it. <laughs> is there is there a deer is there a deer tag there? He'll just take a sturgeon yes. with that. <laughs> no, it's attached to it. It says should say sturgeon on it. It's getting pissed though. Just tell us the truth, Sean. You really didn't have one to begin with. Time is now five minutes before the start of the season. I can see there's more vehicles. It's definitely more light out. Not sure what the temperature is now. I'm sure it's still cold. What are you laughing for? <laughs> Where are those decoys you made? <laughs> what? Did I hear they're in the truck that your father took to go get hey, we got Sean's the license? Bill. We got the cowbell. Yeah, there we go. So it's the time is 6.30, so now we can hang the spears. So that's what we just did. Tuck the rope up under the tube. I got to tie, tie the rope off, and we'll put the decoys in when we... Get a chance. You can see the. It's pretty dark down there yet. So we're 35 minutes into the 